So here is the centrifuge. It's finished and I just wanted to show it off. Show you guys if you ever needed something like this you could build it yourself for relatively nothing. Um, what you could see is I drilled some holes on the fan. I cut the fans blades right off. I kept the motor and I screwed it onto two little pieces of wood and I fastened it onto a piece of wood there and then I fastened that onto a heavier block and I covered it with aluminum. So what right I'm doing right now is uh, I'm trying to get all the pigments I'm trying to isolate pigments from the red and the black um, for a painting project that I want to do so I'll show you as it I switch it on. <clears throat> Keep in mind that the paint is a little heavy, so it's it's heavier than normal stuff that you'll be centrifuging, but it's pretty smooth. I'll leave this on for maybe 25 minutes. When I come back, the uh, I'll ha I should have my final product. I'm, what I'm looking for is just trying to isolate the pigments, and I could just kind of spoon them out from there. So it's just a little painting project. But I just wanted to show you that. I think you can understand how it's built. I don't know if you could understand the electrical aspect of it, but it's very simple. It's just the vent fan has a plug on it, so you really don't even need to do much electrical work. You just can plug that into an outlet or something. But I, I did my own little switch and my plug, and I put a little box on it. Um, that's it really. Thanks for looking. And I hope this inspired you. Bye. Oh, and subscribe.